Callum, a two-point game at half-time became a 21-point 21, 21 game at full-time. What was the difference between the teams in that second 40? Um, I felt we controlled the territory in that first 40. We stuck to our game plan. We did our jobs really well. In the second half, we sort of got away from that. We give them cheap ins to our half. Whether that's through knock-ons, pens, we give them cheap ins to our 22. And there's only so much time you can defend down there. I think if you look at compared to last time, I mean, we lost by how many points, but... I mean, you've got to take some positives out of the game. Uh, I thought we did well that first half. We should have scored a couple of tries, I think. Um, and defensively, we looked good for most of the game. But if you've got a team like Bristol, loads of opportunities. They're going to take a few of them, aren't they? The spirit and togetherness of this group has never been in question. It was on show again tonight. What's it going to take to turn that, that belief, that desire that you all have into the tries, the points, and ultimately the win that you're desperate for? Um, I think we're going in the right direction. I do think we are. Um, there's a lot of noise outside this group. Um, it's quite fun to read about. We're not going to win a game this year and all that. Um, we're not really bothered. Like, we don't care what people think about us. We've, we've, we've got a very much plan in our own group, and it's just about nailing that. And we know we'll get results this year, and we'll shock a few teams, and that's, and that's fine if people don't believe in us, but that's no issue. Um, but for us, it's just making sure that we are clear on our jobs and our roles and what we need to do as a team to do that. And um, We've got limitations that some other teams don't. So we've got to get the best out of the squad we've got, and I think we've got the right people in place, coaches and players, to do that. I think everyone from pundits to supercomputers, as you say, has been predicting Newcastle to finish bottom of the league again. You referenced it in your previous answer. Does it spur you on? Does it annoy you? Does it make you want to, to ram those predictions down people's throats? Um, just sort of ignore it. Like, it is what it is. People can have their opinion. Like, that's fine. They've, they're have they not on this group. Um, they, they don't know what's going on behind the scenes. They, they saw last year. I mean, if I was outside this group, I wouldn't think we win a game. So that's fair enough. But... For us, we're, we're very confident in, in what we can do um, and, the, and the direction we're heading in. Um, made a couple of tweaks this week. We've got Quinns next week away, very similar team. They want to play rugby, they want to throw the ball around. So we set up in the right way to defend that. Now it's just, just about making sure that's an eight-minute performance. Callum, appreciate you fronting up as always. Thank you for your time. Cheers, thank you.